Hello again everyone, as usual, I'm Buff Button. Today we are back with another episode of Pokemon Uranium. Uh, last episode we ended up starting out the Tandor Championships. And today we are hopefully going to continue. I say hopefully because this is my third time recording this video. Uh, not because of video failing, but simply because the other two times literally no progress has been made. I have run into a wall with Kali. Uh, Kali, if you don't remember, is our next opponent. She is the water type gym leader, and I cannot defeat her for the life of me. Uh, I have fought her four times now. And four? Is it four? I feel like it was more. Anyway, I have not been able to defeat her at all yet. Uh, I was at, what was it, level 64 ish or something like that? Uh, last episode taking on everyone. Uh, and then I said I would level up my Pokemon to level 66 off camera. I couldn't do it with level 66. So then I leveled up my Pokemon to level 70. I couldn't do that, uh, do it with them at level 70. So now, I've leveled them up to level 72. Hopefully that gives us enough of an edge to actually defeat her. Now, I know her entire team and the order she uses them relatively. So, I should be able to do this. She starts off with a Tuberiel, which is water and dark. So, what we should do right away is just simply kill that thing with electric moves from Electruxo. Uh, if you do not kill that thing immediately, she will switch out to Brainor, which is water and psychic. Nothing special. So, again, just Electruxo, use Thunderbolt. Uh, once those two are dead, she will send out um, Cocancer, which is the Grass Ground Coconut Crab. Uh, in that turn, we need to use either a Shouten or a Nymphlora. Uh, whichever is, you know, better. I normally go with a Shouten because Nymphlora is way more helpful for the latter part of the battle. Uh, once Cocancer is dead, she'll send out Corso Reef, which is Corsola's evolution. It is water and rock. Uh, that thing, if um, Electruxo is still alive, then we can get uh, mainly with Electruxo, but it has a Focus Sash, so it will end up healing up, or it will um, take two turns to kill it properly. Uh, once that's dead, then she sends out Escartress, which is the water and ground slug thing, which is horrible to kill. The only way I've been able to kill it so far is to use poison on it with Kimikonda and then immediately lose Kimikonda because of Surf. Um, and then basically just stall until she dies. Uh, once that thing does die, uh, her final Pokemon is a Mega Gyarados. That is where I'm stuck now. So I'm hoping with level 72 we can do it. Anyway, are you ready for the next round? Yes. Very well, please proceed into the arena. I apologize if I sound uh, unenthusiastic about this stuff, because I have now done this four times. We're back with round three, the quarterfinals. Of the 32 trainers that entered the arena today, only eight remain. Among uh, These are among the toughest of Tandor, the paragons of our region. I can tell the crowd is loving this. It only gets more intense from here on out, folks. What else could be in store for us this round? Hi there, bud. I want to uh, thank you for stopping the power plant attacks. You really did a good thing for Beale Beach City and for all of Tandor. Ever since I heard about that, I've been itching for a rematch. This time, my team and I are going all out. I hope you'll go all out, too. The rules of battle will be as follows. No items may be used other than what the Pokemon already hold. The battle will continue until either side has no Pokemon left that can fight. If both trainers are ready, then battle start! I hate Kelly so much. I have lost to her so many times. Four to be exact, but you, you get what I mean. Thunderbolt. Just straight up. Kill it. Yep, good. Ugh. The 
This thing is so tanky and I hate it. An aqua jet is just the fastest move ever. Okay, so now... Oh, I got crit! Never mind. I was gonna say now she's gonna switch into Brainor. But she's gonna do that regardless now. Never mind. Go Cancer. Okay. Uh, so we are going to switch into Shouten right away? Right? Yes. Shouten right away. And hope that it does not hit, it, uh, hit us with its Stone Edge. Because that is... The main thing. Alright, so fly will be super effective against grass. Okay. Come on, level 72, please tank it well enough. Thank you. God dang it. Friggin' citrus berry, man. Okay, there's Brainor. Well, um... Unless we want to switch out and take a hit, we are not... Okay, never mind. You're gonna die anyway. It's always something new with her. Every single time. Alright, Electrux, so... On my lucky uh, attacks, uh, lucky uh, attempts, I should say, I've been able to get three of her Pokemon with only one of my Pokemon dying. But, what can you do, right? Oh, come on! And now Electruxo's gonna die. You know what? Screw this. We don't stand a chance. I'm just gonna reload right away. If we die that soon, it is not possible. I'm telling you right now, it is impossible to win that battle. And we cannot use any kind of items, so we can't even freaking revive or heal anyone. It is horrible, dude. Come on. I hate Kelly with a passion. She is the worst person in the world. I would much rather fight Theo than fight her. And I hate Theo. I mean, granted, he is starting to grow up. So, I will give him that much credit. Waterfall is going to bring us to, like, less than half health or something. Bullcrud. No, it's not. Surprise, surprise. Okay. Aqua Jet. That's going to bring us to under half, though. I hate this thing so much. Now, Cocancer. Yep. Let's try shouting again. Because we have nothing else that will work. Because our whole team is weak to her whole team. Like, literally. Oh my god, you're kidding. I couldn't even get a single hit. Jesus Christ. What is Ominous Wind? What is Ominous Wind? It has 5 PP. Plus the target with a gust of repulsive wind. It may also raise the user's stats at once. Not very helpful. Wait a minute, Ghost is good again? Oh my god. This entire freaking time, I could have just... Oh, and now we're frozen. 
Alright, we're starting again. Okay, now that I know... Oh my god. Now that I know that Ominous Wind will work against Psychic... Then again, she only has one Psychic type. Oh my god. Like, I am... I am physically exhausted from losing to her so many times. It is so obnoxious. And the sad thing is, if I cannot beat her in this episode, I'm just going to either have to say no episode, or I'm just going to have to leave it as is. Because, what can you do? Unfortunately, I don't have any more time to record after this, so... Yeah. That's not gonna even get close to dying. I think that was a high roll. Uh, but we're up overall from last time. That's probably not gonna kill it though. Didn't think so, frick. Oh god. Okay, Brain Ore, good. She did not send out co cancer this time. But we also didn't kill it. Dang it! Oh no. Alright, well, we're not dead. Thank god, it is so. <sighs> co cancer, there it is. Uh, yes. Shouting. Is Ghost good against, uh, Dark? No, it's half against Dark. God dang it! Everything we try is just awful. And there she goes again! This should kill, though, right? You're kidding. And there's Aqua Jet. Kelly so much. Corsa Reef already? I mean, I guess. Electruxo doesn't really help much in the rest of the battle except for against freaking Gyarados anyway, but what can you do? Alright, so Thunderbolt, and then it's gonna immediately kill me because we're not gonna be able to kill it. Focus Sash. Surf. The only times I have ever gotten to Gyarados is when we got super lucky RNG. That's it. I guess let's send out a Shouten. Power Gem, good. Answer, good. Okay. Woodhammer, that's a new move. Oh my god! She is changing up her team so much already. This is awful. Okay, so... If I send out Kimikonda... I'm going to have to risk it. Because I need to poison this thing. How did it know I was sending out... Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Alright, new plan. As much as I'm going to hate to do it, I'm going to have to level my Pokemon up even more. 
we do not stand a chance against her. She is literally impossible to beat at our current power level. This is absurd. And obviously we don't have any other way to level up, so we have to just rare candy it, honestly. The only times I've been able to get even remotely close is when I got super lucky. Oh, I forgot to level up Drogon again. I didn't mean to do that. Maybe that one level will help uh, Kimikonda tank one hit to be able to freaking poison anything. There we go. And just so I don't forget, I am going to save. That way I don't have to re-level everything up again. I hate this. I have lost to this lady so many times. This is absolutely absurd at this point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. We're probably not going to kill this thing turn one, but we might at least be able to bring it down to like half health so we can do it like turn two. Oh my god. Even level 75, we can barely get this thing down. How? It's super effective! Is Tuba Real just like super tanky or something? Now Electroxo's not gonna make it to freaking Gyarados. Oh my god! For the love of god, please kill. Nice. Thank you. You're so kind. Of course I'm gonna switch! I apologize, but I am getting really pissed off with this battle. To be completely fair, I guess I really only have myself to blame, because I didn't make a team that was well, um, variety. Okay. You're kidding. Harvest? You can harvest citrus berries from yourself. That's bogus. That's like freaking leftovers plus right there. Of course a reef, huh? I mean, I want to send in Electruxo. But Electruxo is immediately going to die after the first turn. Unless we get super lucky and this freaking uh, paralyzes. I doubt it though. No paralysis. Now Electrexo is dead. Great. I hate everything. Yep, please die. Yeah, 
Yeah, at this point, I'm going on hour and a half of just losing to one lady. And now she's sending out the freaking slug. Nice. I can't switch anything out because whatever I switch out is immediately going to die. Because everything we have is weak to this thing. And there goes the Stealth Rocks. Great. Nice. We don't stand a chance. We might have to level up to 80. I really don't want to do that because that's not entertaining when I'm that OP. There's that. <clears throat> All right. Uh Send in Drilgan, I guess. Because we need Nymphlora. Thank you. Please kill, for the love of God. Thank you. Yes. South Rocks. Super effective. Citrus berry, of course. Thank you. All right, now we are finally on to Gyarados. Do I poison it or put it to sleep? I'm going to poison it. <clears throat> Great, and that lowers the speed too, so that's good. Okay, so we might actually be able to do this now that this thing is poisoned. If we can stall, we might be able to do this. Unfortunately, our main stall Pokemon is out for the count. That thing is dark, so Psychic isn't even going to work against it. Is Dark good against Dark? No. I mean, both of these guys are going to die in one hit regardless. This one's going to die in one hit. Everyone's going to die in one hit. So it's basically how much damage can we get out before, you know, we die. It is not flying type anymore, so Earthquake can affect it. Alright, there's one. Then Poison should affect it. Good. Master Knight, come on, buddy.
Alright. Uh, power gem is really our only move. Okay, now you're dead. Poison's gonna do damage. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sheer dumb luck. That was fun! Screw you! Wow, that battle was quite a workout, huh? I think it's safe to say you're the stronger among us. Screw you, Callie! Go back to your gym, no one cares about you. I'll be cheering you on from here on out. What a match! A thrilling display from trainers and Pokemon alike. Up next, round four, Bud versus Maria. Trainers, prepare your teams for battle, and report to the league attendant when you are ready. I hate everything. I don't think Maria is going to be nearly as hard. Simply because Kelly had something to counter everyone. Literally everyone. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> Electrexo was weak to both grass and ground. Nymphlora, rock. A Ashountain. Rock. Drillgan. Uh, that would be water. Water. Water and ground. So, literally everyone here was weak to her. So, yeah. Not great. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna have to end it there. If you guys did enjoy this episode, then please leave a like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time, where hopefully we stand a much better chance, especially now that we are so overleveled. So, yeah. Thank you all for watching, and have yourselves a great day, then. Goodbye.